So welcome to Matt the Ground Hopper channel. I'm at my next ground. I'm in South London. I'm at Charlton Athletic. I'm outside the valley. So capacity is about 26, 27,000. I mean, I mean, this ground many years ago used to hold about 75,000, which is quite incredible. But obviously not as big these days, but obviously an all seater. Very modern looking from the outside. So I'll have a little wander around the outside and I'm gonna go and find my seat. So we're five minutes in here, Shelton versus Barnsley, really, really lively first five minutes. Really noisy crowd to the right of me behind the goal, opposite the away stand. We've got a drum right at the top tier, banging away. But currently still nil now, but really, really lively start. So there's quite a lot of booing here from Charlton fans. I don't know if there's a bit of needle between Charlton and Barnsley. I mean, they, they don't seem to like each other. So maybe there's something from the past, but yeah, they're proper, proper, proper going each other. Charlton and the Barnsley fans and the players um, making it quite an electric atmosphere, to be fair. So Charlton just had their best chance. We can prepare Barnsley being on top the first 10 minutes, but the crowd are proper up for it today. I'm quite impressed with this. It's really like really noisy. I mean, they played Man United midweek in the League Cup, so maybe they're still sort of running on adrenaline from that midweek game. But yeah, it's good game so far, but it's still company nil nil. Sides, it's like sweeps around as one one stand almost. It's um, I think it's built about 20 25 years ago, but very modern looking from the inside and out. They just need to finish that last bit off behind the other goal. I'm sure, they will one day if they get promoted to the Premier League. But I don't know, but overall, though, good stadium, very modern looking. I quite like it actually. So, um, yeah, it's good for, for League One football. So, I've just hit the crossbar. I mean, 
been Barnsley be very unlucky. They've had many chances this half. Just that Charlton would have scored there, this, but Barnsley be well on top, I think, personally. And they've just hit the crossbar, but it's still 1 0 Charlton. Because it keeps going like this, I'm sure they're going to equalise at some point. But yeah, closest chance so far, but it's still 1 0. So Charlton have been here at the Valley for just well over 100 years now. I mean, but obviously there was a period of time between 1985 and 92 where they were actually evicted from the ground and they were playing at Sellers Park at Crystal Palace and I think the ground shared West Ham for a little bit as well. But they finally come back again to the valley. Obviously the ground needed to be redeveloped because it was pretty tired and you know, run down. But I'm glad they're back here. Obviously they've been back here for 30 years now but I remember as a kid then playing away from the valley for many years. But it's, um, yeah, it's slap bang in the middle of Charlton. It's literally three minute walk to Charlton train station. Okay, we're in injury time with half time. Um, just a couple weeks to go. It's still 1 0 Charlton. But I think and Barnes have been very unlucky. They had a lot of chances, but maybe it's down to good defended by Charlton, to be fair. But um, it's been a really good first half. It's been really lively, really, it's been very quickly the half. But it is into half time. It's going to be a 1 0 to Charlton. So Barnsley have hit the crossbar for a second time in this game. It's quite incredible how they haven't scored, to be fair. But yeah, so he's hit the crossbar, but it is still 1 0 to Charlton. another Barnsley chance um, but it's, um, it's definitely temperatures definitely dropped a couple of degrees it's absolutely freezing sitting here it's not wise what you've got in January in the UK it's just quite an unpleasant experience with the temperature but um, hopefully a few more goals will warm me up but it is a uh, 1-0 start the second half Charlton 2, Barnsley nil. So it's about 20 minutes gone in the second half, still 2 0 to Charlton. I mean, Charlton looked like they turned a the corner because they were sliding down the lead for a bit and seemed very happy when you read the reports. I think it's only three games in a row they win this, moving them up the table, um, Barnsley just inside the playoffs. But I mean, sure, both Barnsley and Charlton, they want to be sort of looking up towards the championship. I think Barnes were there last year, but um, they seem to be very big clubs for, the, for League One. Um, but it's still, currently, as I say, it is 2 0 Charlton. No, 
about, about the price of my ticket. So I got the ticket online. The cheapest ticket I could find was £28, which I thought was quite quite steep for a League One game. It's the most I've played for a lower league game for a very long time. And it just seems a bit expensive. Maybe there are cheaper tickets, but I couldn't find them. So yeah, £28 for a ticket. It's been a good game, but I just think it's a bit pricey for a League One game. Been injury time now. Just a minutes to go. Still turning up to Charlton. I mean, like, you know, fair play to both teams. Barnsley have been pressing and pressing. I hit the crossbar twice. Charlton have defended really well. And um, Charlton had a couple of good chances. They scored two of them. So um, I wouldn't have predicted a 2 0 score line. But Barnsley just on the attack now. No. No. So it's. Um, looks like it's going to finish 2 0.